Hello Pisces and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. I feel like there's a lot of talk about you. Yeah, somebody, I feel like there's a group of people planning, trying to plan maybe um, a way to, to trap this masculine, okay? Uh, I feel like they want you um, but there's a karmic doing all that they can um, to try to get this masculine to marry them. That's the feeling that I'm getting. But I feel like the, the masculine only wants you. They don't want this masculine speaking to you, looking at you, nothing. If they were watching you before, I feel like um, the karmic is like trying to do things to catch their, you know, attract uh, the attention of this masculine towards the karmic. But nothing they do. <laughs> Whatever they do, it looks ridiculous, okay? It's it's not working. They're literally bending over backwards here, and I feel like they're pressuring a masculine to get married. I feel like there's a group of feminines that could be pressuring this masculine to get married, okay? Like, um, to get married to this one karmic. Like, they've got friends, family that are around this masculine yeah pressuring them but your masculine just wants you they just want you they just want you they're telepathically communicating with you okay um i don't think you're picking up on their energy at all you're already out here meeting new people you could have met someone new here you're celebrating your life you could be a cancer pisces scorpio I feel like you could even be on a vacation, you're living a lavish lifestyle, you're out here doing you collective, just enjoying yourself, living your life, you know, getting out there, meeting new people, I feel like this masculine, it's almost like they're preparing to come towards you, um, yeah, look, this is the divine masculine here, and I feel like they're trying to telepathically communicate, but you're not, they can't get through, they can't get through. And I feel like um, this karmic has done everything to try to be like you or do what you do. They could be trying to copy whatever you do for work and everything. But here's the thing, though. You're divinely led. This is, this is spirit. This is the, uh, the divine. <laughs> Every time I see corn, I think of the divine, okay? And, um, yeah, I feel like um, they just don't have the same kind of abilities that you do. Or, you know, you're living a life of your destiny. This is, this is a life that the divine co-created with you. All right? I feel like all they're doing over here is just fighting with this masculine. I feel like they're really trying to force them to get married. Okay? And the masculine doesn't want that. They do not want to marry this karmic. They only have eyes for you, really. Um... I feel like this masculine is under some kind of, like, strict rules not to watch you, not to talk to you, okay? But they can't help it. <laughs> they just can't help it. They can't help themselves. They may even need to sneak to do this, okay? Um, yeah, so the karmic is, like, tightening their grip on this masculine, and uh, they could have been doing some binding spells on them as well. To keep them stuck, because, I mean, I'm the, the binding, right? Keep them stuck, stop them from watching you. I feel like they've laid down some rules, right? They're not allowed to watch you. They're not allowed to talk to you. They can only talk, they can only, look, look at me, though. Look at me instead, <laughs> right? That's what the karmic is saying. No, don't watch the collective. Look at me instead, you know? And look at them. They're Ruth the Acrobat. Um, and so the, the masculine just keeps watching you. You're the one that they want to watch. I don't know what you're doing out here. Um, maybe you're posting some pictures or something. Um, yeah, then they could be crying over this. There could be children involved. The karmic could um, be wanting to hold on to this masculine for financial reasons. Yeah, they're trying everything. I feel like they're trying to get pregnant. They're trying to get married. They both keep watching you, okay? Look at that. And you're out here, yeah, on the pu in the public eye. Uh, a healer, a teacher. Um, 
whatever it is you're doing, uh, your people are watching you and learning from you, okay? And they're watching. I feel like you have some kind of um, platform out here. And they both, yeah. Meanwhile, though, that this karmic, I'm telling you, she cannot stop your person from being interested in you. She cannot stop this masculine from wanting to be with you. That's it. And she's getting angrier and angrier and blaming you. He's, he doesn't even want to focus on what she's doing anymore. She's already trying too hard. She's trying too much. And now she's trying a trap. It's either to get married or have a baby. Okay? I'm telling you guys. And meanwhile, you're just over here doing you. Yes, thank you. You're doing you, collective. Okay? You, whatever you're doing, this karmic is trying... <laughs> Look at this. Whatever you're doing out here on um, your platform or social media, or it could even just be for work or fun, whatever, you know, you've got some kind of craft or you could be like a, you could be like a um, physical therapist, something like that, or just like a, you could make workout videos, you know, <laughs> something like that. They're both watching you on a glow up here. It's brought you to a very comfortable life, but this is your calling. This is what the divine wants, okay? And you're very, very skilled. You're very, very accomplished here. And the, this karmic does all they can to study you, to watch you, to try to be like you, um, so that this masculine will focus on them, and that's not working. The only thing they have left is to try to trap this person, um with a marriage or a baby and they may even think about getting uh, pregnant with somebody else's baby just to keep your person stuck okay i feel like you and you just keep on winning you keep on winning they could maybe even be trying to find out some kind of um like get some kind of evidence or something on you um to try to bring you down because this karmic wants you out of the picture, man. They they kind of, they want to fight. Secretly, this karmic wants to fight with you because this masculine can't stop thinking about you. Cannot stop thinking about you. They want to come towards you. I feel like um, you're in both empress and emperor energy right now. Yeah, look, because this is this is that soulmate connection, okay? Um, I'm also feeling this massive fakeness off of this karmic, I, I have to say. It's just, it, at this point, it's actually having an opposite effect of what they want, okay? Because, yeah, thank you, because this, this masculine does not want this karmic anymore they're like oh man please don't do another crazy stunt <laughs> right right please don't try to act like the collective it doesn't look the same it's like you gotta be kidding me here right um it's having an, an adverse effect every they're just doing way too much meanwhile you're disconnecting from all of this you're um, in a place of peace. You're focused on your stability. Your um, masculine and, and feminine energy here combined. Empress energy, emperor energy here. Um, you could be a business person. You could own your own business, your own platform. It's making you very abundant, very stable, very strong. You know, and they're watching you out here enjoy your life. They're watching you meet other people. And this masculine, I feel like they're becoming very stressed out. Yeah, well, at, look, people are watching you. You may feel like you're in a fishbowl right now because it's like all eyes are on you. They're continuously watching you, everything that you do. Okay? They're watching everything that you do. Um, I'm also feeling like the karmic is, is watching them. Yeah, your person knows, you know, here's the thing. I feel like there's a friend of your person's that's been watching you too, and they want to come towards you because I'm seeing a friend of your masculines, right? These two are buddies, but they're both in competition with each other. Um, and your person, they may hate this, I'm telling you. 
but you're a tr you're out here attracting the attention of so many people okay so many people look at this and one of these people in the crowd is also this divine masculine's buddy Okay, it could be this person in the back. He's pretty good looking too. So, you know, um, I feel like this masculine knows it too. They're being divinely led. This is being spiritually led towards you here. They can't handle the karmic's antics anymore. The karmic's little schemes and tricks. They can't handle it. They're, they're on to the fact that they're trying to act like you and be like you. The karmic's getting angry. They want you out. They want you gone out of the picture. Okay? They want to fight. That's kind of um, what they daydream dream about is fighting you or having you gone. And they're doing all that they can to plan a, a wedding <laughs> or a baby with your person to keep them stuck. Um, yeah, but that's not. I feel like that is not going to happen. Your person, if they're going to get married to anybody, if they're going to propose to anybody, it's going to be you. It's going to be you. These two may be together, but they're not focused on each other. The masculine is focused on someone else, and this karmic is focused on you as well. So I feel like this is not, um, that's not going to happen, man. I feel like this masculine, if they're going to propose to anyone, they only want to be with you. I feel like you're leaving the scene, and you um, you may feel very burdened by this. Like, you may be wondering, you know, do you just want a free ride, right? Are you going to put in the effort? Um, I'm going to calmer waters, and you want to get in my boat with me when I'm hitting all of this financial stability, and I'm so strong and successful? Do you just want a free ride here? You're, I feel like there's something about you that's not going to trust this person. Um, yeah, I and I honestly, they're being spiritually led to you here. And I do see a masculine with the, you know, dreaming of being with you and not this karmic, okay? But I'm not seeing them approaching you quite yet. I see them still... Kind of like, what have I done? What kind of mess have I gotten myself into? Now I feel stuck. I feel trapped. I can't get out. I'm dealing with this fake karmic here who wants me to get married. What, what? You know what I mean? So they haven't, they're not, they're, the divine is leading them to you, but they haven't yet taken any action. Okay? They're only daydreaming about this. So you're the only one that they're going to be proposing to. Okay, but you're, uh, you're, I don't think you trust this person at all. Um, I feel like you also, you know, you're, you're, you've got your momentum, right? Whatever it is that you're doing, um, you're loving what you're doing. And this is what your main focus is, okay? It's brought you to a very comfortable life here. Um, and I feel like maybe you're thinking anyone else, Right. If you if you were to get with anyone, it may drag you down. It may slow you down. And right now you're very business minded. OK, you're focusing on your craft. So, yeah, you don't want that to happen either. You know, and I feel like the way you're standing here, you're protecting all that you've built. You're protecting yourself. And I feel like it's almost like you're saying, you know what? If anybody has anything to say, you better come and say it to my face, you know. No one has yet to show up and look you in the eye. No one. I feel like you're just like a force here. Um, man. <laughs> Your energy is coming through like a beast, you know what I mean? Um, in a good way, in a good way. But yeah, you're just very strong, you're focused, and you're very protective of your path. Oh yeah. You're showing, you're like fearless out here. That's what it feels like. You're, you're, you're showing absolutely not a smidgen of fear. You're fearless, you're confident. Yes. 
All right, so what else can you show me here? Yeah, I feel like this karmic is trying to either trap this person with a baby or a commitment. They may feel like if they get pregnant that your person will have to commit. So they can, you know, trap them easily that way. I don't know. This is what they're thinking. Are there any other messages here? Yeah, your person wants to put in the work with you. But I feel like you guys are ending the cycle and moving on with your life. What else can you show me? Yeah, they want to put the work in. You could be, this masculine could be like somebody like a construction worker or something. Yeah, they don't want this, they don't want this, uh, this karmic anymore. It completely turns this person off. Um, yeah, they're about to confront this karmic on this. They want to tell them the truth. They're both going to tell each other the truth. And I feel like it's going to, it's going to pop off. And I feel like this person, they're, it's a, it's a complete turnoff. They're shutting this karmic situation down or they're going to try. And I feel like they're leaving a home situation here, whether they have another place to be or not. Ooh. And here, you know, I feel like you're, you're out here winning. This is, this is who they want. This is you, Collective. Out here winning, being spiritually led and protected by your ancestors, okay? You're the one that everybody is watching, all eyes on you. Whatever you're out here doing, um, you're on a spiritual path. And this is why you're winning, right? And I feel like um, each one of these medals is just a big win for you. Now, this is what you're protecting, right, is all of your abundance, and you just keep on winning. Um, but whatever it is you're putting out there, like I said, remember when I said you could be a spiritual teacher? I feel like your person has learned from you because they can't stop watching you. This person, since the karmic told them they can't watch you, or talk to you, this person spends a lot of time in their car watching whatever you're doing on the internet, okay? <laughs> there, or they could be watching you, you know, like, like this could be somebody watching you outside your work, watching you work. And I feel like, yeah, in you delivering these messages, whatever you're out here doing in the public eye, they're one of your biggest fans, and they're learning this too. And now they're having an enlightenment here. Okay? You're teaching them maybe about spirituality or this connection or some kind of spiritual healing. Okay? Now they're becoming spiritual. This person, now they're vibing way higher than this karmic. It is not going to work in that situation. I'm telling you. I feel like neither one of them really want to focus on each other. Both of them are just focused on you. That's another reason why it's not going to work. And I feel like you are being spiritually protected here by your ancestors and led. Okay? And now your person is starting to get creative. They're starting to find their own creativity their own way of expressing the messages that they're getting. I, strong twin flame energy here, okay? Because your person's very intuitive as well. So they're starting to get creative. They may even um, start putting things on the internet, you know, about the things that they've learned from you. How about that? You know, and meanwhile, the karmic is just trying to be you, and it's just not working, right? They're getting all kinds of mad. Yeah, they're about to lose that relationship. If I'm telling you, if this masculine is going to propose to anybody, it's going to be their divine feminine, you know? I've, I'm sadness here on the bottom of the deck. I feel like, yeah, they're, uh, they may, I feel like they're leaving a situation. There may already be children involved. Um, and they're, they're sad about that. Okay. But, um, yeah, they're being spiritually led as well. Yeah. This person, man, they're on their way to you. And, uh, no rules are going to stop this masculine from watching you and seeing what you're doing. Um, let's get what they want to say, though. Okay. 
What does this masculine want to say to the collective? So that karmic situation is, is coming to an end. This masculine and the karmic are going to go at it toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Um, a lot of truth is going to be spoken, and I feel like it's, it's going to be a tower moment. It's going to be bad, you guys. <laughs> that breakup is going to be bad. Um, so many things remind me of you. I should have believed in you. You always had my best interest at heart. The distance between us is killing me. I long to hear your beautiful voice again. Just being near you is intoxicating. Yeah, they don't want to be this far away anymore. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. I will wait for a sign from you. I feel like that's what they've been waiting for, a sign that they can approach, but you're not giving them any sign. You're completely focused on you right now, okay? I wonder if you still think about me. How do you feel about me now that you've had time to reflect? I have awakened to our connection. See, I'm telling you, this is a person on a, an awakening, and I feel like you're the one... Um, you're the one who helped trigger them into this. Um, I know we have a timeless bond between us. Yeah, they could be studying this connection, the twin flames, right? When times got tough, I gave up on you too soon. I have to be in contact with you again. I miss you too much. I'm confused about what I should do with my feelings for you. I regret lying to you. Letting you down was the worst decision I made. Yeah. Yeah, this person's, uh, all they can do is think about you. I feel like they do want to talk. They want this soulmate connection. Right now, they're still feeling a bit stuck with this karmic, but once they break free from that, which they are, they're both going to be having it out. It's going to be a massive fight here between these two. And your person will be leaving that situation, whether they have a home or not. They're, um, yeah, they're shutting it down. And I feel like um, this masculine could already have a ring. But I, you know, I don't know. I feel like it's going to take them some time to come towards you, but they do, they, they can't stop watching you, okay? Neither one of these people can. They're both obsessed with you. All right. All right. 